Hello, everybody. This is Coach Bob. Uh, what I'm going to show you today is a drill called shoulder drop. What uh, shoulder drop does is it really teaches or it gets an athlete to feel where their weight is. As you can see, uh, the setup to this is the, the ball. Your partner is going to have a ball the height of a shoulder. The hitter is going to have all their weight, not all their weight, but they're going to have equal distribution of weight into their front leg and the back leg. A lot, uh, there's a saying in, in baseball and softball to stay back, and I think uh, I think that gets misconceived as um, hand staying back versus weight staying back. I think it, uh, a lot of people believe that their weight has to stay back. In reality, you will not get to the ball as quick if your weight is in your back leg when you initiate your swing. So as we... Uh, the setup is uh, weight 50-50. The ball is dropped. Uh, and as you can see, this it's less than a half a second. And and you can see where the hitter is initiating their swing with their back elbow. Um, you see this back elbow right here driving down, going into the ball. Back knee, back hip is starting to fire forward. Once she gets connected, her front hip, her front hip will start to work itself back, and the bat head drives forward. You can see her hips get fully turned before the bat head gets released. So this is what we're looking for, uh, what we call the shoulder drop. Again, the setup is weight 50-50. Ball's at shoulder height. Ball gets dropped. Initiate the swing with the back elbow and the back knee.